Hey y'all! So I'm coming at you with a Wednesday what's it slash chit chatty type of video and also just to talk about unpaper towels more basically. I finally got the stuff in for them. My fabric.com order finally came. So I'm going to share that with you. So I'm going to start with the stuff for the unpaper towels which I'll link a picture of somewhere or I'll show a picture of somewhere up here what unpaper towels look like and I'll post the link again to that person's like DIY. So I'm very excited. I shouldn't be this excited because I was like I probably will knock this camera off of here. <laughs> that could happen. So the first thing I ordered is what looks like a giant towel which it kind of basically is. So I ordered three yards of terry cloth white fabric from fabric.com. It was very reasonably priced. The shipping was so expensive to get it here, but hopefully it will have been worth it. And I found some other sellers on Etsy, but I'm a little leery because I know like when I order from fabric.com, like it's 100% cotton. So it's one of those things where you're like, but uh, it's so expensive for shipping. I think I paid like 25 or 35 dollars in shipping. It was a lot. I paid a lot of shipping. A lot, a lot. So I got three yards, so I'm excited. And I forget how wide this is, if it's like 44 or 56. Um, it says the order number is 147600034 if it's something you're interested in. But I overcast stitch the edge because I'm classy um, and because I don't know how soon I'm gonna get to wash this and it was you can't really like it was definitely starting to like fray fray a lot there so got three yards of that and then to do the other side you generally want like a really not like so there's all kinds of flannel, you know, so you want like a good solid 100% cotton flannel. This one I think was the Kaufman one. So this one is only like 34, 44, 24, it's not very wide. So I just got a white 100% cotton and I got four yards of this one. It is, it says it's order number 147600034. So I'm excited, I just got like four yards of that. Um, it's a nice solid, like a cotton um, flannel, which is what I've seen recommended for in the DIY tutorials that I've seen. So, I'm so excited. I also ordered more snaps, but not for unpaper towels, just because I have projects that need snaps. Also, I can't, I can't get this bag in the bag now. Sorry, that took me a while to get that back in the bag, so. Who knows how much of that I did it out. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so this is the Robert Kaufman 100% Navy. I picked up three yards of this. This is 56 inches wide, if I recall correctly. And yeah, so I'm excited. It's really beautiful. Boop, boop, boop. I got three yards of this to go with. And this is 100% cotton. And when I was ordering from fabric.com, this was part of the colorway for that. So, oh, but I didn't tell you. So that flannel, the reason it's narrower is it's called a diaper flannel, which I, I don't know. I don't have children, so. Or any being in my household that requires a diaper. I know some people put, like, you know, like pets have potty problems. So anyways, I'm getting off topic, but three yards of this and I'm very excited. 100% cotton. I overcast stitch all this stuff before I show it to you. And it gives me a little bit of a chance to kind of feel the fabric, touch the magic. So, and then this is the terry cloth in the color royal. So pretty, and it's like this is so nice. 100% cotton, I picked up three yards of this. And again, from fabric.com, so. So really, I just have to run a load of laundry and get it done. And then I ordered a couple of fabric samples, which I'll show you because I, I love ordering fabric samples from fabric.com. I just, again, so expensive. So I ordered this because I had ordered a sample of the black yarn dyed rainbow. You'll see I bought, I ended up buying that fabric. This is the Kaufman Essex yarn dyed. I believe this is the emerald. 
147600, oh, that must be my order number. Yeah, it's a sample swatch 0539413S, I don't know. It's 44 inches wide, it's the, I think this is the emerald color with the metallic. But like, I've never seen fabric that has like metallic yarn shot through it that is as soft as this is. And then I picked up this one, which is an Alexander Henry. It is a cotton fabric. And I just love the prints they have, so I don't care. I And I've seen a lot of people that actually use these for fabric or shirt pockets, and I love it so much. I just need it in my life, okay? I wanted to see what it looked like in real life. So this is the Alexander Henry Fabrics 0594845, letter S as in uh, Shannon or Sunshine, I guess. And then I picked up three yards of this fabric. This is the Alexander Henry. This is also 100% cotton, also uh, 44 inches wide. And I just really liked it. They have a zombie one that I saw Top Customs have and use, and it comes in several colorways, but it's really a hard one to find. And I dream one day to own it because. It's just such, I just like these like kind of unique prints like this. Is it 0679283, I believe? And then last but not least, guys, this is the Kaufman Essex yarn dyed. So I don't know if it was, I don't even know if I showed it, but like I ordered from fabric.com when I went to my parents' house. And because they do free shipping, you know, if you're in the contiguous US. So I picked up a sample of this, I think it's, it's the Kaufman Essex yarn dyed and it's rainbow metallic I think is what it's called. If someone's really interested in let me know and I'll like find my previous order and link it but if not I'm lazy you guys. So, but, oh my god. And it's so soft. I think that's the thing that amazes me is it is a metallic fabric that is like, can you see the magic? And my lights do not do this just, justice. Like, I... Yes, yes. I showed it on my Instagram stories because I felt like that was, like, the... It really did show it off because I was doing it earlier in the daylight. But, you guys, it was amazing. I originally bought that fabric, the rainbow fabric. I'm going to call it the rainbow fabric. The rainbow, uh, the Kaufman Essex yarn dyed rainbow fabric with the intention of making fans. But I kind of want to, like... I would love to get some more and make like like all the things with it because it's one of those that's really pretty but it is only 44 inches yard wide so I definitely need three yards to do pants because I put on some panini weight so from the panini so yeah so that's been a thing but yeah so that is it I went through this very quickly which is like amazing for me but also I sort of had things like lined out and figured out how I wanted to talk about them so anyways so I hope you enjoy that I'll try and remember to link to fabric.com below but I will say it's the shipping here like if you're not in the contiguous US it's hella expensive but it was worth it because I couldn't find anyone else that kind of carried all this fabric in one location so I bit the bullet and I think they all to think no they didn't have any sales I wish so anyways that was where I was at with life so if you stuck the, through it this long I appreciate it <laughs> yes. uh, please remember to like comment and subscribe and I hope you have a wonderful evening morning afternoon whatever it is wherever you are I will talk to you later bye bye